Your WCBI First Alert AccuWeather Forecast with meteorologist Vanessa Alonzo. Monday morning. Thank you so much for joining us here on Sunrise. We are waking up to a little bit of some mist and some fog forming. We've been watching it on our low cloud satellite over the last hour. You can see that mist and fog out in the distance this morning on our Alpha Insurance Skycam in downtown Columbus. Temperature is currently at 73 right now, 74 in downtown Tupelo with some mist and some fog forming as well. Now, we haven't had any reports of low visibilities in our southern counties. So if you live in our northern counties and you encounter that mist and fog this morning, slow down, take your time as you're getting to your final destinations. Now, the top weather stories we head into the new work week will be the very hot, humid conditions that we're going to be experiencing here. For today, mostly sunny skies overall, temperatures topping out in the lower 90s. But with that heat index, it's going to feel like near 100 degrees out there at times. And it's only going to get warmer from here on out. This could possibly be the hottest week of the year so far here in North Mississippi and West Alabama with those heat indices making it feel like near 110 degrees at times. So please take the proper precautions to stay cool and hydrated. Now we had this cold front that pushed through yesterday afternoon that brought us those showers and thunderstorms. We have high pressure building in from the north that's keeping us dry right now, but this ridge of high pressure over the southwestern United States will be pushing into the central plains, and this is what's going to be responsible for the very humid, hot conditions we're going to be experiencing here. Throughout the next several days, we'll be topping out a couple degrees above average in the mid-90s, but again, this is not factoring in the muggy, humid air that is going to make those heat indices feel hotter than it should be. So we're not under any heat advisories or heat warnings as of yet, but definitely take those proper precautions and check on the elderly, the pets, and your kids. Make sure they're staying cool and hydrated. Drink lots of water. Chances of showers and thunderstorms return for the second half of the week into the weekend. Again, it is going to be a hot one for us, so stay safe. We'll be right back after this.